Amber, a lot of people going out to a bunch of events for Veterans mm -hmm. Day yeah. today. What can you expect? So Mother Nature is cooperating. We're going to stay dry. We're going to stay mild, but it is a little chilly this morning. So if you're heading out the door right now, grab the layers. Here's a look at our next weather sky cam. This is LAX. Still no, uh, none of that marine layer that we normally would typically see. So that is why things are just a little bit chillier. And you can see all the blues here on the board. We're looking at temperatures below freezing for Lancaster, 31 degrees. We have upper 40s for Santa Clarita and also for Claremont, mid 40s for the Simi Valley area, upper 40s for Burbank, upper 40s also for Fullerton, 48 for Malibu, and we have 52 near the airport at LAX. So with our next weather forecast, this is what we're watching for. Mild, dry, but lots of sunshine. There is a chance because we are tracking a system passing to the north of us that it could bring us a slight chance of showers overnight. Not a huge rainmaker, about a tenth of an inch or less if we do see anything. This will be a quick moving system, and as soon as the system leaves, we start to see the winds pick up and develop overnight. And so that means starting tomorrow morning, we're going to start to see these really gusty offshore conditions. So wind advisories have already been issued and these are the areas under that wind advisory. So you could see portions of LA and Ventura County. We could see gusts here up to about 40, 45 miles per hour. Otherwise, I do want to set that wind future cast in motion for you so you can kind of see what's happening. We're going to have a really nice Veterans Day and then later on in the evening we start to see a little bit more of that sea breeze picking up. It gets a little bit stronger so near the coast we could start to feel a little bit more of those winds but take a look at what happens overnight. You can see how the winds shift to more of that northerly, northeasterly fashion as we head into Tuesday. This is why we have those wind advisories uh, being placed for parts of LA and Ventura County because we will start to see these winds kind of drying out the atmosphere, pushing away any of that left over moisture if we do see any showers overnight. Our next weather hour by hour forecast. We're going to start off the morning with temperatures in the low 50s in the next hour. We'll stay that way. We'll stay in the mid 50s. That is by 8 a.m. And you can see gradually warming up as we head toward the afternoon to the upper 60s, low 70s. For the Riverside area, we're looking at low 70s as we head into the second half of the day. You can see lots of sunshine. Again, our rain chance. We do have a chance of it as we head into the overnight hours, but the better chance of rain Rain will be toward the end of the week. We're looking at another system that could bring us rain for both Friday and also parts of Saturday. Next weather future cast. This is the system. We could get the tail end of it. Some of it could fizzle out, but it's definitely pushing in much more of the colder air as we head into the overnight hours, and it could also drop our snow level. So mountain snow can't be ruled out. Maybe a dusting as we head toward the end of the week. This is that next system that we are watching, but for now we're just going to enjoy the sunny, dry conditions, and then with those winds picking up, it will drop temperatures down for some parts as we head into Tuesday and then those offshore winds will help warm things up for Wednesday and Thursday before the cool down begins toward the end of the week. All right, back to you.